Hi everyone. I look for a lot of the different secrets and mysteries from all around the world, looking for the coming of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, Emmanuel, the Son of God, who has risen from the dead and took all the sins of the world away. Now the world elite, the Illuminati, the Freemasons, and even the spiritual realms that are all around us, they leave their signs and secrets right in front of us. In symbolism, on our channel, we bring all this back to the Word of God and show how we're nearing the end of days. Today we're going to show how we're nearing the time of this fifth trumpet ready to go. And that during Obama's time, see here, Obama, during President Obama's time, it represented the time of Wormwood. See here, this BP oil spill during Obama's time. Where the waters are made muddy. Then we had Obama with the Flint water problem. And he even drank some of the water. Here, that's talked of in the Bible. And it's even shown all the way back to these ancient glyphs. This one here of Akhenaten and Nefertiti, which has been compared to Obama and Michelle Obama. <clears throat> this representing Obama and what is known as the burdens of Egypt. To come out from underneath the burdens of Egypt is what's talked of in the Bible. Then you can see over here the V for the fifth trumpet coming. Because we had the Wormwood and three in the fourth trumpet and then the fifth trumpet, which will have some things to do with Donald Trump, who lives on Fifth Avenue. See there? That's the burdens of Egypt. You can actually see a ghostly Egyptian right here inside of Michelle Obama's dress that was painted for her Washington portrait. You see him in there? The dark guy, which represents the Revelation 9 beast from the pit. See him right in there? Walking like an Egyptian, doing something with his phallic, with his penis area. See that right there? The burdens of Egypt. See, that's what is talked of in the Bible. And you can see the V. See how she's almost sitting the same way, right there. Well, you can actually see Donald Trump and Obama on here. How is this done? It's This stuff is all around the, the world. God talked of in the Bible that many, many people would wake up and be able to see these things nearing the end of days. And you can actually see that they're both on here. The third, fourth, and fifth trumpet. There is Donald Trump with this pirate guy going down into his pineal gland. See it there? And there is Obama with this one little character going inside of him and the mask of what some say might be the man of perdition. Or the mask of Loki being passed back and forth. And this is the satanic figure controlling them like puppets. See it right there? So you can see that we're in the, this time of these trumpets. The Wormwood. Revelation 8, the first four trumpets. And the third angel sounded, and there fell a great star from heaven, burning as it were a lamp, fell upon the third part of the rivers, and upon the fountains of waters, and the name of the star is called Wormwood. And the third part of the waters became Wormwood, and many men died of the waters because they were made bitter. The water is messed up now. This bitterness is spreading. Then we had the full eclipse in the USA on August 21st and 22nd of 2017. And a fourth angel sounded, and the third part of the sun was smitten, and the third part of the moon, and the third part of the stars. So as the third part of them was darkened, and the day shone not for a third part of it, and the night likewise. Now we're nearing the time of the fifth trumpet, and the three woes. Woe, woe, woe. That's what's coming next. Revelation 9 1 1, just like when the Twin Towers were hit. The fifth trumpet, and the beast, the smoke out of the pit. There they are, right there, walking like an Egyptian. See, that represents the burdens of Egypt, all right in front of us. You can actually see on top of this glyph, mapped out, part of the biblical end times, and the mark of the beast right on it. See this guy right here with a mark of the beast on his head, like a number? And they're going to come out with this new type of Eucharist, is what's talked of in the Bible all the way over to here where they're even doing things with the eyes. See it all right there? 
See how they're messing with the people's eyes? And that is the microchip called the mark of the beast in the Bible. See, I'm putting it right in there. It says they will take this like a microchip to control your computers and buy and sell things. They will blame it all on terrorism later on. So there you go. There it all is right in front of us. And that's how both of them are in the game. Because it all represents part of the time of the trumpets. Of Revelation 8. The first four trumpets up to Wormwood. And now we're at this part. The fifth trumpet. The bottomless pit. Confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead. And you'll be saved. Hallelujah. That represents the burdens of Egypt as talked of in the Bible. These evil things right there. God have mercy on us all.